Hi guys, Chris here from Heed the Ball and welcome back to Project Bundesliga where we're attempting to take Tasmania Berlin all the way from the 6th division of German football all the way back to the Bundesliga where we spent one season in 65-66 uh, and they broke all the records for the number of low points and low scoring, low everything and at the moment we're in Division 5, the Oberliga and things are, yeah, they're not going that well just the one game to catch us up on. We lost 5 2 to the league, league, lead, uh, league, uh, blah, 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 league leaders, Lichtenberg. And uh, yeah, we, we were beat winning 5 0. We came back, scored 2, but yeah, things are not too good. We won the two friendlies, and now we're playing Use Trollers. And we're at home. I've changed the tactics slightly. We're going for a 4-4-2 again, I know I keep changing it to 4-5-1, trying different things, but it's the only thing we seem to be getting any results with, but we're going for a direct counter attack rather than, you know, wing plays or, or just direct hoof ball, so we're trying long balls, nothing's been working, the transfer front, things things are not good financially behind the, behind the scenes. Um, got asked to cut my budget about two months before the transfer window opened they cut my budget near enough in half and said oh by the way I want you to reduce you're spending too much in wages but I'd already committed to for the season so I've had to get rid of a few players but much of muchness because I had to bring a couple in so Eric Sen he's away decent enough player I'd like to keep a hold of him but I need to get rid of some money off the, especially to bring players in. Tim Brettenberger, who I wanted to play in as a centre-back, he's away. Yeah, he's not bad, but yeah, he's never going to make it at this level. He's away back to Turkisport Berlin, who, as you can see, I've nicked two players from. Andreas Althunger, again, had high hopes for this boy. He um 22 goals for Prusen last season. He was a foreign on our side. Came to us looked like he couldn't kick a ball so yeah I'm disappointed but you know these things happen but just anybody I'm touching at the moment is just not happening Kofi Katwag has came in um, decent enough attacking midfielder midfield centre you can probably do it all you can pass a bit so yeah I'm happy happy to have him and uh, his teammate this is a special one this is the goalkeeper so I finally got a top class goalkeeper for this level and he's injured. <laughs> Two to five weeks still. But he's a big, a huge improvement. If we just look at the, at the triangle, compare with, compare with my Seagun. Yeah. Almost, almost every level apart from intricity, which we, we don't really want. So yeah. He's going to make a huge difference for the coming in. But at the moment, he's just injured. So that's our luck. These guys are fourth. They're probably going to spank us. Because we've been getting a lot of spankings recently. And we're going to go with Seagun and goals. Uh, Setin, Kylar, Kostrati, and Pokovic. And then in midfield, Amrel, Eundorf, Straten. And Morak, and then up front, Yuzadowski, and this is a name you don't be familiar with, but he's from our youth academy. And he's been training really well, his physicals and mentals are reasonably decent, his technicals aren't, but at this time I'm just willing to try anything. Everybody's lacking fitness and sharpness because we've been on our winter break. Mark, he can have 8, because that's a good 8 number, and 11. <coughs> so let's see how we're getting on and put your bets down how much we're going to lose everybody's playing that 4-5-1 and I've had a look our team is not that bad like considering considering the way we've been playing we probably do have about the 6 best squad I've had a look at everybody's teams and our players are pretty good but I just don't understand how we just can't make that step up 
so I'm yeah, but I'm frightened if I do get that sixth, a top half finish this season, and we keep our job, the the board are going to request something like win the league or something next season. Which I imagine will be, oh, here we go, three minutes. Oh, Seagun wouldn't have saved that. To be fair, Seagun wouldn't have saved much. But yeah, I got offered the Finn Harps job in Ireland, which was uh, unusual. You said they were. Oh, back, was that a back heel? I'm out. Throw it in. I'm out. Straight in. Oh, we've got a shot on target before the 75th minute, so we're, we're doing well. Yeah, so Finn Harps job, got offered the Finn Harps job, and it was a. Uh, they won their league, so we were going to play the Irish Premier League. Oh, there we go. No, oh, Kevin Newendorf. You might have mopped that up, mate. You're the defensive midfielder, and yeah. Well, you can take a shot like that all day and day. So, yeah. Made me think maybe if we get sacked here, could turn this into a journeyman. <laughs> because, uh, obviously. Clubs are appreciating what I'm doing, even if Tasmania Berlin board aren't. Kedaisky. To be honest, we could be doing with him in the box, but I can't take these free kicks off him just yet. I think that's maybe why we're not playing as well. He's the, he's the main man. But he looks kind of a bit like this is, this is maybe a, just a step too far. He's, Scored 45 goals last season in the league below. Yeah. The ratings are sort of poor. The ratings have been poor since we stepped up to this level. I can't get more than two players to be in the green. So yeah. It's pretty interesting. Yeah, well doing better than the last couple of games where we've been five down. <laughs> it's probably the way we're going to have to try and grind out results because we are better than the majority of teams in this league but we just can't find a tactic that suits us. And yeah, Kaveski's not been very good on his debut. We'll maybe just put the, the speedster on and draw me. Just uh, freshen things up because well, I meant to. I'm too busy sobbing to to do a team talk. Maybe we just ignoring them. Didn't do anything of, of use, so don't talk to me. <laughs> so yeah, this is a bit better than I, I expected. I'm not going to see anything. I usually say I take a point and then they, they score. And I've just said it, so they're going to score. Jadowski, straight in. Jadowski, straight in. Jadowski. Oh, I thought it was, he changed it up there instead of Tam Rail. I thought he was going to straight in. Oh, he was going back there. If that had been on target, I think that might have been in. Straighten's looking like struggling, we'll get the, get the new lad on. Quarteg. Just straighten. Let's see what you can do, mate. He's got a bit of pace about him. Straighten's good, though. Ooh, that was violent. Oh, Monarch. I stumbled across a promising tactic here. Oh, is that a goal? It is. Right. Please. 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 <laughs> right. Rack's overwhelmed by the, the praise. Everybody else is fired up by it, so you're wrong. Yeah. You 
kind of have to sub see that it's now oh defenders are actually defending it's oh another one oh that's fruity there we go chase it chase it chase it right this is gonna be a counter Quite happy. Ah, don't hit it, it's Seagun. Oh! Right, they're coming back again. Right. Shout. Demand more. The shouts seem to have a reasonably big effect in this game, like bigger than the years before. Yes. Be fair if you told me we weren't going to be five down by the 78 minute, I would have taken that. So. Creative, what's this create? Oh, inspired. Inspiration. Things are going nicely well. I think we found our, our new tactic. Defenders actually look like they can defend. The midfielders look like they can midfield. And there we go. 1-1. One, one. And I'm a happy man. Team talk. Uh, oh, okay, it just wasn't our day. We could have won that. I think. But. Let's. Um, yeah, that was pleasing. Hopefully for a be better second half of the season. So yeah, that's um, I like the four four two, and I didn't really want to move away from it. But everyone else is playing that four five one, so yeah, next next season will be interesting. Uh, Twenty one points, we're five points off of that that golden ticket of eighth place. So hopefully we'll. We'll push Seago all the way to not Seago, eh, Griffles Wald. So yeah, what we'll do is I'll have a look at the the schedule. I don't want to leave it too late. I maybe want to try this out the next three games. So we'll come back for Aldersdorf and Grief. All right. Well, thanks very much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.